I have had the pleasure of knowing Alex since I had the day I was born. And Alex has been my best friend, but more like an older sister. I always, you know, growing up, I thought of this day, us getting all dressed up, you or me or whoever it was. I am so happy you all blossomed together over these past a lot of years. <laughs> um, even though you've taken her away from me and then brought her back, thank you, finally. All I ask is that you make her happy and stay patient with her. And don't kill yourself on that stupid bicycle. <laughs> so cheers to y'all. I love you. <laughs> I met Alan freshman year of college, seven years ago. And I met Alex very shortly thereafter. As I was thinking about it and I was getting the speech ready, I realized that there was just one thing that was always the common denominator and it was Alex. I don't exactly know Alan without Alex. And um, They say great flames start from a small spark and I've never seen that spark extinguished. And so fun to see how far they've come. And you know, I always knew that we'd be here today and it's just crazy to me. I, you know, in closing, I just want to say, may your for better or worse be far better than your worse. So if you please join me in a toast to the happy couple. All a father wants is that his daughter's taken care of. We knew pretty early on that Alan had that covered. All the best to Mr. and Mrs. Alan Ramirez. Alex and Alan, this is a, a marriage is a pledge between two people, as you know, and you've made some vows and commitments to each other, and you've also exchanged rings as a public symbol of your marriage together. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Mr. Ramirez, you may kiss your wife. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my honor and privilege to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Ramirez. Thank you.